Welcome back everyone. Today we're on Mines and had Type 59. Now, how many of you actually knew that I had the Type 59? Well, I imagine a lot of you actually knew, but how many of you have actually seen me play in it? I haven't played in this tank in a long time, mostly because I feel that, at least for me, it has been replaced by the T-54, which is that Tier 9 medium. Now this is a Tier 8 premium medium, so you can see I've got a lot of premium rounds loaded. Actually, I've only got 5 standard armor-piercing rounds. The rest, the other 29, are premium armor-piercing. Actually, what's their technical name? Are they... Okay, they, they're APCI rounds. High, exp high penetration? High penetration? Armor-piercing <laughs> composite rigid. Okay, that's way off. Anyway, now we're going to sit here. I was going to go up on the hill, but I decided not to. I decided I was going to back off if there was a lot of enemy there that could shoot me. Because I wasn't worth taking, like, eight hits. And sure enough, there was lots of enemies that could have hit me. I would have ended up hurting, like, that T-32. Or I could have got tracked multiple times using my repair kit. Got tracked again, kind of thing. And been dead. Now, a couple of them got greedy. They really wanted that T-32. That uh, Kernavern, as well as, I think it was a KV. Oh, no, just an IS there got greedy, cost them their lives. Now I'm just going to peek through here. And for some reason they keep feeding themselves to me. Oh, that completely missed. That was very unlucky. But we've already let off all our five standard rounds, so now we're down to all premium. Ooh. That Indian Panzer there. That premium. That, that thing scares me. It seems like it doesn't care if the other tank has armor. It just, it just devours any other tank that it hits. And its armor itself is pretty good because it slanted so well. So now we're going to wait for our next target to appear. Got this 1S here. He's not paying attention. Maybe we can hit him. Ooh, there's a tastier target. A T-29, but we didn't quite get a chance to hit him. Okay, Bruiser's there beside us. He's taken quite a few hits. A few more than I'd like. He has a, a bad habit of kind of forgetting how many hit points he has left. Oh, back up, back up. He's going to get hit. Oh, I tried to save his life. But the Indian Panzer got to him. I saw that he was really low on health and that Indian Panzer was going for the kill. I tried to back into his way really quickly. But it just didn't quite work out in time. I tried doing that so many times and it's never worked out for me. However, I have a video I released just the other day that you guys probably saw by now. Where a friend of mine in the platoon there saved my life doing the exact same thing. Different map, slightly different situation. But he saved me from my own stupidity. Oh, look at that. They stopped the cap at 96%. Oh, and there's a couple enemies and a few big TVs. Look at that. Now we bounced off the, the glass cannon. Or else it absorbed it with its track, one or the other. Okay, that one went through that glass cannon. We call them glass cannons because we've got big guns, but very little armor. Oh, that one got absorbed by the track as well. Those guys got a little lucky there. Now, I'm trying to build up the courage to push forward a little more. Ooh, that ricochet kind of scared me because I didn't think it was one of the two tanks I'd already spotted. Oh, sure, sure enough. Must have been that guy. I just can't quite get a hit on him, though. He's just slightly behind the rock a little bit too much. I was waiting for him to peek out. Oh, I can see him over, but that's a very difficult shot. My shell hits the, the top of the rock there. And even though I'm missing a lot of premium round shells, shots, I'm still gonna make a profit at the end of the game because this is a premium tank and anytime I make a majority of my shots at least count in this thing I make a profit even on a loss when I get destroyed just because of ammo because this thing makes so many credits and its repair cost is so cheap that's just that's the good thing about it there we go finish out that type 59 now we're gonna run up the hill here maybe we could take out these TDs at least one of them before we capture, maybe we can get another shot off, at least that would be enough to make me happy. Because another shot means more credits, more experience. And who doesn't want more credits and more experience? Moving in here. We're willing to take a hit. We got our engine, no, that's not good. We'll finish him off. Oh, he almost killed himself by ramming, okay. Ally takes the kill, that's fine. Now, <laughs> with a dead gunner, <laughs> we managed to hit him in the last few seconds of the battle. Not bad. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you for the next one. Bye-bye.